بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم این امپارٹنٹ ایشو ریگارڈنگ اسلامک پنشمنٹس از دی نوشن آف آر جیورس دیٹ اف اے کرائم از ناٹ فلی اسٹیبلشڈ دے سی دیٹ دا ہر پنشمنٹ کین ناٹ بی انفورسڈ ان دیٹ کرائم ہاؤ ایور تعزیر کین بی گیون ناؤ وی نو دیٹ بائی ہر پنشمنٹ وی مین دوز پنشمنٹس وچ ہیو بین اوڈین بائی گاڈ وچ ہیو بین فکسڈ اینڈ پرسکرائب بائی دی آل مائٹی اینڈ بائی دا تعزیر پنشمنٹس آر آر ریفرڈ بائی دوز پنشمنٹس وچ آر وچ ہیو بین فکسڈ اینڈ پرسکرائب بائی اسلامک اسٹیٹ Now, they base their view on a narrative of the Prophet, a narrative attributed to the Prophet, and the words of the narrative are Idra'ul Hudud Bishubhat, which says that the Hudud should not be implemented if there is a doubt. Now, on the basis of this uh, narrative, it is said that Hudud shall not be implemented when there is a doubt in case of the crime. Now, the cardinal mistake which has been committed in this is that a term which was coined much later has been relegated back and interpreted as some, a common Arabic word uh, as used in this, uh, this narrative. This narrative uses the word as a purely common Arabic word. It does not use it as a term. So, when used as a and commonly pure Arabic word, the word had means punishment, regardless of the fact that the punishment is a had, that is a punishment ordained by God, or a tazir. It just means punishment. So, in other words, what the narrative actually says, that in cases of doubt, no punishment shall be given. No punishment at all shall be given. It is erroneous to conclude that the word had here means the had punishment. As I said, the word had as a term originated much later than what it has been used here. It has been used in this narrative as purely a common Arabic word which signifies a punishment regardless of the fact that it is a had punishment or a tazir punishment. So the bottom line is that in cases, of, of, uh, in, in cases when a crime is not fully established, No punishment at all shall be given. There is no, there is no uh, uh, middle state between a crime being proven and not being proven. Either a crime is proven or it is not proven. We cannot say that a crime is 50% proven or it's 60% proven. We can only say that either a crime is totally established or it is not established. So therefore, if a crime is established, then the hard punishment shall be given if, 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 the, if the, uh, the situation is such. And if it is not established, then no punishment at all shall be given. It is erroneous to say that in such cases, uh, the tazir punishment shall be given. As I said, this erroneous concept or this erroneous inference has arisen because the word had has been interpreted as a term in this narrative. Whereas it is used as a common Arabic word in this narrative, signifying the fact that in cases when there is a doubt in, in matters of a crime, then no punishment at all shall be given. Akulu kwa lihaza, wa staghfirullah li, wa lakum, wa lisayir al-muslimina wa al-muslimat.